<laughs> All right, don't be mad. I forgot my charge thing upstairs. So I'll be right back. Okay. How's everybody doing? Uh, hey, Carol's chaos. <laughs> Waiting on the slow folks. I was back there. She's a liar. Hey, Moon Goddess Treasures. I don't get to click on everybody's comments. Wait, can I? No, because I'm not the boss today. Hey, Fairy again. Hey, De Denise. Mari. Hey, Lindsay Ann. Hey, Carol. I don't want to miss anybody. Um... Hope you're all having a fantabulous evening. I hope there's some new faces in here this afternoon. Because I don't have much new to show. Ida! Hi, Ida. I missed you. Um. Ain't got much to say cause I'm a boring human being. I'll make up a song. You're not boring. Everybody sing a lie. <laughs> hey, Barry. Hey, guys. Teresa. Ida. Lindsay Ann's dog. My camera sucks. Hello. Hi, Linda. My name is what? My name is. Oh. Apparently, I want to wrap this this afternoon. This fine evening. Oh, there we go. Oh. Huh? I gotta figure out a bit. Hi, the humble barn. How are you? So, Gina will be here. She's just not here yet. I'm sorry, Carol. What did you do to Carol now? I didn't know she fell. You fell? Don't do that. Get I came back, but y'all was gone, and... I saw that you got to sell, and I was mad at her. I said, you sold with Teresa, and I didn't get to sell with Teresa. And I had to clean my house. My dad had a friend over for the first time in, how long was it? Like 28 years, so it was a little unexpected. Thursday, sell, do, 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 do. What's the day, day, do, 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 do. Still, the phone fell equals I fell. <laughs> brat. What a brat. So, I do have a big garbage bag full of clothes from my mama. I can show those today if you guys want me to. Uh, she's a little bit smaller than me. and It ranges from anywhere from size large to, um, to size 2X, usually her stuff. Is. So, if you don't need to get the clothes, you can sound off and I'll run out and get some. While we can still be back in the And I shared it out all over the, the interwebs of the Facebook and of 
Instagram. I tried it on Instagram too. I think it's on my phone. I feel like I can't talk to people that way. I think it's on my phone. Oh, I could try this. That'll be, this will be good. Is there anything I can stick this on? Let me just put you guys right in my face right here. Ew, does that noise me? Yeah. I don't know. I want to put you guys. I hate that noise. Am I at. Um, was it her? Hang on. Okay, can you guys hear that or is it is it my speaker thing? Because it drive it's driving me nuts. Let me know if she sounds ridiculously crazy. Oh, Awesome. I can hear a machine sound. I I hear it. You said your sound's fucked up. Dude, it's my air conditioner. Oh, you're I better. Can... You're better now. Well, that's because my air conditioner cut off. <laughs> I mean, they gave air conditioner to the prisoners in Angola. Finally, y'all can let me have my air conditioner. <laughs> I'm gonna try my best this year. Oh, I don't know how this is gonna work. Well, that's gonna make you sideways. Okay, hang on. I'm trying to figure out a good spot to put you guys over here. It doesn't make me go insane. Oh, oh, I know what I can do. Maybe. All right, while I am messing with this, I'm going to let Lucid start. Throw you right there. And if I'm making too much noise, just let me know. I'm going to try to figure out a way <laughs> to... Meh, meh, there y'all go. Now, this is a, what do you call this, a uh, pitcher, and it's Majolica, and it's got a big rabbit, and a bird, and another bird. And Miss Christie's here to help us out. Pheasant. Um, he's going to start at 40. And... I don't know if I type that right. I'm upside down. So, um, there's another bird. It's got flowers. There's like a whippet or a greyhound dog. There's his little tail. Some more birds. There's a fox, a mallard duck. And then the front's got this beautiful, like, um, some type of palm, feathery look. And. It's got no chips or cracks or damage that I can see or find. And it is signed. Um, what did I say that name was? Thomasine. Not Thomasina, but Thomasine. And it's really pretty. I mean, I love their choice of color in this piece. And dude, I swear... I had my tape measure. No, no way. I was like, tonight I'm going to have it next to me. And I put it next to me. And do you know? Do you know it's gone? Okay, let's see how tall this bad boy is. Um, let's do it. I guess the top of his ear would be the tallest. And he is ten and a half inches tall. And at his... 
widest point, I would say he's roughly eight inches. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. I just dropped and broke two things. Not one, but two. And now I think there's glass over here and I can't find it all. Oh, welcome to my life. <laughs> Bro. Okay, so next up, I have this frame photo. It's kind of in a shadow box frame. Um, I did measure it and it's inches tall. And it's like got some kind of matting. Somebody painted the blue right there. And it's also got the little hangy hooks in the back. And it was sold by Lynn's Hallmark. And probably a really long time ago. And it says Totem Elephant Shadow Box. And so they're little carved elephants and that. That's the butt facing out towards everybody. The top one's facing towards everybody. Yeah, I know. I just took you off. Hang on. Okay, now you're back. <laughs> um, let's see. I'm going to have to back up just a smidge. And that's going to be a $20 start. Where are the other chips to this plate? I don't want to put these in my foot. Pretty good size. Like I said, it's 16 inches long. That's a frame. And the um, width is and a half. So Fuck balls. Sorry, I broke three things, and one of them was one of my favorite vases. So as you can see, they're like all carved out little elephants. Lucid brings out. Well, I mean, I have more bigger ticket items. I broke this beautiful vase. I know. <laughs> I mean, maybe that's for all those times you laugh at me when I break things. God was like, I'm going to smite you today, Miranda. Well, I was trying to put my phone up here, but I have like, I have like glass and um, trays stacked up there. And it, some of it started to fall and I just didn't catch all of it. And it just went down and just smashed my phone. But um, those are my two. Could have been worse. All right, well, I got to go throw this glass away, so give me a second. Just show, just show one more thing. I'll be right back. Oh. Okay. I just have two things ready, so I'll just show this next item. Um. It is a Fenton custard glass bowl. It does glow for, like fluorescent green. And it's got a pretty like floral paisley looking pattern. It's got ruffled edges. And the bottom side is marked Fenton. If I can get my camera to show it. And wouldn't you know it. Can you re guys read that? And um, and what's your start? <laughs> That's gonna be a start of forty dollars. And uh, I don't know if I'm a black. Person. Okay, so did you guys want me to get um? Did you want me to grab the clothes? Just say yes or no. Um, Lana, I checked my email this morning, so if you didn't do it this morning, I have not seen it. So I'm going to say negative. That's a negative Okay, so that's my, um, three. Mm-hmm. 
Alright. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Okay. Hi. What am I doing? Jump. That's what's happening. We're in a you're in a weird position and then I'll play with you a little. Okay. So tell me yes or no for the clothes. Um, and then the next time we go is I can I cannot go and check it out. I am not sure what you think I've seen it before. And then every hour I am going to do a giveaway. So I'll do one real quick because I didn't do one at the start. And then at 9.30 I'll do another one and then 10.30 and then so on, depending on how late I am. So the first giveaway is going to be, I think I'm going to give away a hard good this time and i'm gonna do these i don't know if anybody's gonna want these but i'm gonna play these glass cream and sugar dishes and the first person who says got them can can have them as long as you have an open order with me or plan on getting something to clarify to clarify And Carol's got them. Okay. Thank you, Carol. Now it is up to you guys to remind me so I don't forget. So at 9.30 or 10, whatever your time, in an hour from when I started. Um, so in about 45 minutes, we're going to do it again. Do not forget to tell me, okay, because I could easily forget about it. Stay base. I almost lost that vase. I'm breaking everything today. <sighs> okay. And I will go get clothes after this next turn. Okay. So. What are we going to show first? Let's see. Let's do. I really don't want to do anything with it. Let's start with some littles. Uh, this was a $3 start. We're just going to do a dollar start since it's a small item. $1 start it is like a lily candle holder thing. Can Fairy have the broken glass? The glass I just broke? It's I broke a little pottery jug in half. I broke a plate in half. And then I broke the side of that vase. I don't have all the glass to it though. So if you want to fix it, it's going to be your... It's not going to be great. <laughs> uh, the only one you could probably fix, like, seamlessly is that little jug. She probably wants yeah. to make, like, jewelry out of it or something. But I guess. And then, Denise, if you are here, I did get your email. She did have a pedestal. Her little green pedestal dish broke. And out of all that glass and stuff that I've packed and shipped, I'm pretty happy. A daffodil, a buttercup. I don't know what it's called. Whatever this it is, isn't at one. Does anybody want to come in at two? <laughs> Man, okay, I have any guys up there. Hurts my neck. All right, if no one else is interested, we're going to call it to Ida. Flower yellow. Hey, Denise. I don't think I hurt myself. I got a little bit of dried blood on my hand, but that's from something else. And my feet aren't bleeding, they're just a little dirty. And I haven't stepped on anything yet, so. Hopefully I'll be alright. Hmm. Glass only. I think the only thing that's glass is the blown glass vase that busted. Hey, Quintia. Alright, I'm gonna assume it's sold. Thank you so much. 
the other. That's fine. Um, this is going to be just a dollar by it now. It's a little doggy. But bear thing. And he like sits on your shelf or your tea or something. Uh, one dollar buy it now. Throw down the word dog. D O G. Oh, my ankle's just itchy. <laughs> I'm not a mess. Well, I can just add it to your stuff, Fairy. It'll be fine. Yeah, you can put it on a planter. I don't really know what it is. Does anybody want it for a buck? Julie's gonna take it. Thank you, Julie. And for my third item, it was a $5 start. We'll knock that down to three. This is gonna be a $3 start and it is a cute little bunny. With big eyelashes. And there's no chips on the ears. It's a little dirty, could use a little wipe down. Looks like it's got a small chip under the foot right there, but it's very smooth. You can't notice it when it's sitting down as well. Anybody into my bunny? Michelle P's in a three for the cute little bunny. Any other interests? I'm doing the dance with my arms. I don't know what I'm doing. It's fine. All right, let's call it to Miss Michelle. Cute. Bunny. All right, Bunny Fru Fru's hopping through the forest and going all the way to Australia. All right, while Lucid is going, I am going to go grab those clothes. This is a crystal candle palette from Ulta. It's a two piece. There's the base, there's the top. It's um, just shy of 12 inches, so 11 and three quarter inches tall. It's got like roses etched into it. Fancy like Hollywood Regency shell like parts. It's um, overall a re really pretty piece. There's no damage to it. And I'm gonna start this out at 40. Go away, shadow. I can't get more light where it needs to be, so it looks poopy. Oh, did she? Great. That's nice. Um, and then there's a the little bottom. That's where you stick the candle in. And then for a $3 start, I have this lot of two prints. This is Wild Roses by Percy Tarrant. And this is from the Fine Art Manchester Center in Vermont, and it is signed by Andrus. Well, it's a print, it's not his real signature. So there's a little girl kind of sitting in the woods, typical 70s like landscape, I would think. Um, maybe not 70s. And then this one is these little people.
All right, you can go ahead and sell it to Ida if no one, no other interest. And that was my two. Oh, was that your two? Yep. What is that perfect time? Okay. Well, we're doing three. Did you show three? <laughs> No, we are doing two. Well, did you? Well, you showed three the first time, right? And then I showed three, so you just want to do two or what? Uh, it's fine here. Look, this is a cup. It's like swanky swig size. It's really pretty. It's um got mushrooms. It has a hummingbird. It has some snapdragons. Butterflies and broken glass over here. Go for five dollars start and I guess you could burn a candle in it if you wanted. Or just you know have it as window art. Teresa's in a five. Thank you, Teresa. What is oh, it's a cat. Get out of here. Michelle P's in at six. Da -da 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 -da. Hey. Thank you, Michelle P. I want to show you guys the cat, but it's impossible. Teresa's out. Hey, Kevin. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, Michelle P. Okay, that was my three. Okay. All right, just a quick disclosure. My mom does smoke. I don't think any of these clothes smell like smoke. They smell like she just cleaned them. She also does have a dog. It's a little chihuahua. So, disclosing. And some of this stuff is, is mine to keep, but I don't remember what it is. I don't think that's going to fit me, but that's so cute. Oh, I wish. All right, so up first here... We have, and the stuff that she gives me, I'm supposed to, like, list it. Um, she doesn't give it to me to, like, you know, so it starts a little bit higher. Um, but if you do pass it, it's okay. I will list it. All right. This is Harry Potter, and it is a large, extra large, a 14 to an 18. It is a gray Hogwarts sleep sweater dress. It is stretchy. There's nothing on the back. And this one probably came from Torrid because a lot of my mom's stuff comes from Torrid. I'll do a $10 start on this one. What happened to Kevin? And then it has the Harry Potter tag here. Oh my God, Kevin Club is back. Oh my God. Kevin, Kevin Club, I'm so sorry to hear your dad has cancer. Aww. I was wondering about you the other day. I was wondering where you've been. It stops about two inches above my knee. Yeah, it's either, it doesn't have torrid sizing on it, so it could be from, there's three places my mom shops the most. Number one is Torrid, number two is Hot Topic, and number three is Walmart for PJJs. So... <laughs> She used to shop at like Kohl's and Yonkers a lot, but like not so much. So um, it is a size large, extra large, and it is a $10 starch. And if there's no interest, just type pass for me. It does go, um, it's about, stops about two inches above my knee. And I'll put it to this side here. So we'll add Gina. Hey guys, sorry I'm late. 
Oh, Harry yeah. Potter, I will take. So, Kitty Cat, you want it for 10? Just confirm for me. It's all right to be late. <laughs> <laughs> Just type confirm for me and I'll write you down. Okay, kid? Kid, kid, kitty? Get listen. It's fine. My brain's all over the place. All right, so let me know if Kitty Cat says yes or confirm in the chat and I'll go into the next one. Um, this one is a Torrid and it is a size double zero. All right, Kitty, I got you. And it is an off the shoulder tie dye sweater. I actually have the same exact one because me and my mom like to match like that. Um, this one, uh, she's about a 14, 16, sometimes an 18, but I say she's she's pretty much in the 14 to 16 range. She's usually an extra large in most stuff. So I would say that's about how this one would fit as well. Probably like an extra large. It is meant to be a little oversized. So keep that in mind here. And this one is Torrid and is a tie-dye sweater. And this one is going to be a $10 start as well. I promise not everything's going to start at 10 but this one does as well. And it is slightly off the shoulder. Plus, if you get it, we can match. You know, one shoulder on, one shoulder, one shoulder off. And then the one that I have, I think it's, uh, mine's probably a size, a size two or size three, and so it's a little bit more oversized and a little bit longer. Um, this one, I don't know if it would go past your butt. It just depends on what size you are. I could put it on, but it would be skin tight on me. It's very cute and tiny. Looks like I got fairy in at 10. Does anybody want to come in at 11? So I will put this guy in this bag for kitty. So your clothes are going to come in the bags for now because uh, I bought like 100 of them. Well, I got them for free, but I got a lot of them. I don't have everything on hangers, so I can mark it that way. If you guys knock down those breakables, I might snap. Okay. And my mom loves Harry Potter, too. I don't know if there's going to be any more of that in here. Okay. So... Fairy came in at 10. If there is no other interest, we can start calling it to my fairy girl. Fairy. Oh my goodness. All right, we're going to go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, four, three, two, and one. And we're going to be sold to fairy for 10. Perfect. All right. Um, next. This is stitches. This looks like this is a size large. It's from the Iowa Wild, which is a thing out here. It's our like hockey game, I, hockey team, I think. And it's a uh, like a baseball style tee. This will just be a five dollar start. I think it's our hockey team. Are you our hockey team? <laughs> I have no idea. And that one's a five dollar start. And it's a large, but it definitely looks more like an extra large. Hey, can you not chew on my bubble wrap, please? Okay. Yes. Okay. So. Hi. All right. I don't see any action. If you guys do want it, just let me know. Gina, are you ready to go? Or do you want me to put you in next time? I am ready whenever. All right. Here you go. We're doing uh, three. And uh, I'll just put loose it on after you. And we'll go in our I tried bringing my, my box light in here and it's a little weird. Hey guys. Hey Tina. Hey Kristen. I got some amethyst towers in today, so I guess I'll start with those. 
Hey, Patty. All right, let's start with the bigger ones. Uh, this guy, I have one $12 one. This guy's a $12 buy it now. And I'm going to show three $15 ones after this. This is the only $12 one. And then I've got all smaller ones after that. This guy is 12 <laughs> Hey, Carmen. Oh, what are you doing? Hey, everybody, anyone I may have missed. Hey, proud American. So that guy's 12 and then I'll show you the $15 ones. This is number one. He's got a little bit of a carving out here near the bottom. More purple near the top, more clear at the bottom. $15. <laughs> Sugar Club, yeah, you may as well just say I'm in the closet here. <laughs> I can't do my, my regular um, spot this week. Uh, it's in there. That's number one of the 15. Thank you, Patty. This is number two of the 15 before you tell me which one you want. Number two has some like smokiness going on right here. Kind of cool. It's number two of the $15. Smokiness on the side. And then number three of the 15 is this guy here. Sorry, Christy. <laughs> oh, I'm, I, I've been used to typing. Thank you. I'm sorry. I appreciate you. I don't know why they do that to you, Christy. They just don't appreciate you. I do appreciate you, Christy. And I, I missed you when you were gone and I just got used to typing. And I, even though you're right here, I just typed. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, thank you, Patty. You're in first. Would you like number one of the $15? With like the cutout near the bottom. Number two has the smoky side. And number three looks like that. I was trying to sing under the noise of the air conditioning and then it turned off. My phone is being possessed. I don't even know where my phone is, but I know it's dead. <laughs> Number two, the smoky. Good choice. That's really cool. That one. I really hope no one else can hear that. It sounds awful. Thank you, Patty. How many are we showing? Oh, three. nice. I'm normal again. Uh, we're doing three, but we can do two since there's three of us now. Lusa, do you want to do two or three? Bro. Uh, let's do three. Okay. Still going to do three then. Okay. So this is the $12 one I have left, and I still have two $15 ones left if anyone's interested. And then my second item will be more amethyst towers. These guys are smaller. And Christy... <laughs> They will be, oh boy, they're a range here. Okay, we've got a three, four, five, three, four, five, and then two sevens. Three, four, five, seven. <laughs> Sorry to make this more difficult. Three, four, five, seven. Here's a $3 one. Buy it now for $3. What are these? Amethyst Towers. Oh, okay. Here's the $4 one. Here's the one $5 one. And then here are the two $7 ones. This is the first one. More purple at the top, more clear at the bottom. And the second of the $7, it only has a little bit of purple at the top, mostly clear. Kind of cool. A lot of really cloudy in there, too. Sort of a lot to look at. 
I think that's pretty neat. Perfect, Christy. <laughs> All right, thank you, Patty. The uh, four dollar one. That one is yours. If anyone's interested in the three, five, or the two sevens, just let me know. Set those aside. And then my third item will be, I have these Buy It Nows. They're faux stones, pretty sure they're faux. $2 buy it now's choice. $2 buy it now choice. Your choice of a malachite, a faux malachite. $2 buy it now choice. Or a what looks like a faux howlite. Or a faux snowflake obsidian. I hear that faux mine has really great crystals. Who does? The faux mines. The what? Faux mine, where you go mining for those crystals. <laughs> really? Have you ever been? <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'd like to go and check it you out. You should go sometime to the faux mine. That sounds like a faux, faux fun time. <laughs> Thank you for liking my bad joke. <laughs> All right, those are $2 if anyone's interested. Thank you. So these are my two. I look, I found my tape measure, so I put them in the display. These are my two mugs. They're cat in the hat mugs. Um, they're going to be a $20 start. This one is Oh, the Places You'll Go. It is from 2017. That is the other side. So it's that little dude on the spinny thing. And then it says Dr. Seuss on the inside of the cup. And it's got a blue inside. And I believe this is Oh, the Places You'll Go as well. And it's these guys on like a rainbow with nets trying to catch things. I don't think I had this one when I was a kid. And it says, let me take this light. Jesus Christ, light. It looks better in the dark. Congratulations, today's your day. You're off to great places. You're off and away. And it's got a little dude. He's walking. And on the inside, it's got these little, instead of saying Dr. Seuss, if I can show them, it has these little balloons. And... Um, I've seen this one. I mean, of course they range in crazy prices for, you know, more than $20. So it's a good deal. I didn't, I took them out to list them and I hadn't really gotten them yet. Taking their pictures, I forgot. And so, yeah. I figured I'd do them before I list them. Is it a lot or is it choice? No, it's both of them. A lot. What's your start? Sorry, I didn't care. It's okay. It's twenty dollars, so it'd be like. I don't. I don't want to really break up the pair, so. And this That's is a really good price, honestly. Yeah. Um, I want to say this one's like 17 ounces or something ridiculous. And this one's probably about 10 ounces, I would say. I know 17 is almost big enough for my coffee. <laughs> almost. <laughs> okay. Michelle pays are not 20. Thank you, Michelle P. Let's 
it's, it has like a, I want to say it's 20 ounce and it's Nightmare Before Christmas in a box. Mm -hmm. I, yeah, I haven't tried to resell it or anything. It's like sitting there in the box. Mm -hmm. All right, and we can start selling it to Michelle if there's no other interest. And then my next guy is this matador. I do believe he's a handcrafted ceramic piece. And he has, you know, he's older and he has like some wear to the paint in some places. He is 12 inches tall. Um, golden sword, black suit, he's wearing a tie. There's his red cape. Um, let me back him on up some more. There we go. And he's just so pretty. I like his shape. And see, there's a little piece of paint wear there. And there's his backside. This may be a chip. Um, looks like he's got some little, like, hairline right here. I don't know. He's G-shape. He's probably kept on somebody's porch from 1974. Dude, that all you have to have is red nail polish. Six yeah. <laughs> well, and, and then get you a little bowl and look awesome. Anyway, mm -hmm. I'll start him out at twelve dollars okay. for the matador. He's pretty to look at for sure. I love yeah, him. Very, very masculine, pretty. Yeah. <laughs> He's very masculine, pretty. He is. He's handsome. Look, look at his, look at that. He's got that tiny waist and then big old booty. Like what? Yeah, Mantadors. They were face. always very manly men. Okay. And next up, let's see. I don't know. But they got all the chicks. I have, um, wait, was that my second? No, that was my second. Okay. I have these two decks of spare cards yet left, I mean. Bless you, bless you, bless you. They're going to be a $12 start. Um, this is the Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Kranz. And this is the Dreams of Gaia Tarot by Brian Bellin. 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 So Gaia means Earth. So this one's got, you know, let's see. It's kind of hard for you guys to make out because they're so tiny on the box, but kind of some of the imagery on the cards. And then I saw a scene on this one, but I think this is more like a shocker deck, but maybe, I don't know. And so $12 starting bid choice. Uh, what was the first tarot? Not the Gaia, but the other one. Um, The Wild Unknown Tarot is what it's called. Yeah. I do you believe it's a shocker one? Because I remember I did get a shocker. So I said this is my favorite team for last. Well, I mean, there's one more if you're into, like, super dark tarot cards. I mean, I'm not. I don't think y'all would be, so I never brought it out. The darkest I've seen is the vampire set. Do what? The darkest I've seen is, like, the vampire set. Oh, this one's, like, um... I thought it was going to be like an occult one, but it's just really weird. I'll have to tell you about it later. <laughs> I'm interested. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You may not be. You might be. So nobody's interested. Just let it say pass if y'all aren't interested in the um, cards or the matador, and we can move on. Those are really, really nice decks from what I can see. 
That's one good choice. I was planning on keeping one of them. Do you like cheetah print? This is no boundaries, extra, extra large. It's a black sleeveless tank. This is 91. We'll do a two dollar start on this one. A one, two. Cheetah. Oh my god, I keep bumping into everything. I'm gonna break everything. Um, I could stretch it to fit me, but like I said, my mom is a uh, she's like a 14, 16, so like an extra large. Carol's in it too. Oh, I coughed on it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Anybody want to give it a three? Carol, you can retract your bid. <laughs> I'm not sick. I just get like phlegm because of like I smoke. You know that smoker cough? <clears throat> that and I coat my throat with coffee and it makes me cough. I'm trying to stay mute during this, dude. I'm trying to maneuver myself around Denise's box, which somehow she still has. There is not like COVID on it. I've actually never came into contact with COVID that I'm aware of. Like nobody in my immediate family or friends, like not like no one's gotten it that I've come into contact with. Mm -hmm. ever. I did once, didn't want it anymore. Yeah. And I travel across country and didn't come in. My, I came across it and I think I should have gotten it, but I must be one of those. I think it's got to be like a genetic disposition for some people because my physical therapist had it and was like, you know, massaging me and bending right over my face and stuff. And the next day she got, you know, tested positive for COVID and like I didn't get it and her husband didn't get it. I don't know. It was crazy. So you must have just been like a carrier, or if you were at all, if you didn't get sick, you just could have been a carrier type thing. I don't think, I mean, I had no no symptoms of anything. So. Yeah, and I, I know I'm not a carrier because there's, there's, I've been in contact with way too many people, and literally no one I've been in contact with has, has gotten COVID, so I know that I'm not, like, giving it to people. True, and that was the same for me. Like, I didn't bring it home to my dad or nothing. Like I, kissed, like, I kissed my grandma and she's fine. <laughs> Very lucky she's, and not susceptible like time. And she's yeah, like, yeah, oh, man, oh. totally. Because for some people, it's terrible. Some people lose limbs. I mean, if they survive, you know, they lose limbs. And like diabetes yeah. and stuff. And heart capacity and all kinds of stuff. Yeah. I don't all think right, it's, it's yours. I don't think it's just um directly correlated with like illnesses like diabetes and kidneys i think also like i don't know it has to do with your phenotype or blood type or whatever yeah and if you're possibly prone to getting i didn't think i was but i didn't well, you know, all right this is no boundaries size extra extra large this is an olive green sweater it ties at the bottom we're going to do a $3 start on this one. And on me, I think it's meant to be a crop top. She is like a shorter status, so she just wore this as a normal sweater. Anybody want to come in at three? For that olive green. Hey, Joyce. Does that want to pass? Three dollars start on a double XL for that one. <laughs> Excuse me, if somebody does want it. I got a little cheetah print top here. Body emergency. <laughs> yeah, right. This one uh, is a boutique top. It is by Love J. It is a size large. My mom took this for me a long time ago. I don't know if she ever wore it. 
if she didn't wear it, then it's still a brand new boutique top. It says L'Amour Paris. And this is a cropped shirt, severely cropped shirt. And we'll throw a $3 start on this one. I don't think she ever wore it. I think her boobies were too big. It still has a little tag thing up here. Hey, Pat. Is it $3 start? Yep. Really cool. I think I wanted to keep it for myself, but it is like it's really short on me. You know when you put a shirt on and it like just barely covers your nips? That's the kind of crop this one is. You can wear a sports bra under that and still be a nice crop. Yeah. Well, I mean it's a size large and I'm like a size two X, so on me it's very, very cropped. On someone who's a size large, it's gonna be longer and fit you better. Dude, gold. <laughs> I got some shirts that were gold. But it's really cute. All right, it looks like we're passing that one too. Passing on to Gina. Am I gonna see? I'm here. Okay, maybe I'm not gonna see. That was rough. All right, I got some more stone towers. I'm gonna show some eighteen dollar ones. Your choice. Eighteen dollars. Your choice. We're showing four here. We have a firework jasper. It's number one, 18. Number two is a blue adventuring, or it could be denim lapis. I actually think it's denim lapis. Wow, Michelle, that sounds very good. These are a little taller than the usual. They have a new variant of the virus. Too many things. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I didn't hear about that. There's number two. Number three is natural highlight. And this has some really pretty areas of the quartz running through it. Like, where's that really pretty spot? No, this wasn't the one. It does have the quartz running through it though. And then the last one, number four, is a bloodstone. And again, these are a little taller than the usual tower. That's why they are. 18. And the forms. Again, number one, fireworks jasper. Number two, denim lapis. It's okay, Lindsay. I totally understand. <laughs> Number three is natural highlight. And number four is bloodstone. So those guys are 18. And then my second item, I'm gonna show more towers. These guys are 20 and 22. 20 and 22 choice. 20 and 22. These are the two $20 ones. Maria, how's it going? <laughs> This one here, this is a beauty here. This is like a, I don't know if this is considered an ocean jasper or like a crazy lace, but there's a lot going on here. That was window jersey right here. Window jersey right there in the center. Really pretty. Lots of crazy lacy stuff going on on this. This guy is 20. And then the second $20 one, another really pretty one with some druzies on it. Again, this uh, 
I'm leaning more towards an ocean jasper, but it almost has like golden healer type yellow stuff going on in it. Really cool. There's a druzy right there. There's actually two druzies. There's a druzy right here and two more druzies actually, right here and here. Two really pretty druzies near the top. That golden color almost kind of looks like it's on top of it, kind of like in a golden healer. <laughs> Let's see. I know these, I haven't shown these ones yet either. They are just so pretty. I've been hesitant to keep them. So again, that's the second $20 one. Really pretty. And then I'll show the $22 ones. The first one is a blue appetite. Taller than the average uh, tower. That's why it's 22. Taller and thinner, I guess. Pretty blue appetite. Nice blue to it. Blue appetite is great for joint pain, arthritis, as well as encouraging appetite and curbing appetite. I've heard it's good for both. Like it goes both ways for the appetite. And then the second $22 one is, this looks more like an agate, like a crazy lace type of agate because it's more um, transparent than the other one. But this one's really cool too. Um, the druzies in it aren't super sparkly, but the do it does have some vugs, and some of the vugs have a little bit of a, a mildly sparky dru sparkly druzy in them. But really cool. Lacy banding going on on this one. Hey, Maria. We have Miranda, of course. We have Lucid and Christy's Modding. So that's the other $22 one. Really cool towers. So if you're interested in any of the $20 ones, this one is stunning. Or the $22 ones, just let me know. And then my third item, I'm gonna show some clear quartz and an aura quartz. Christy, they're all $10, $10 choice. $10 choice. Here's number one. Number one is a clear quartz. It's a $10 buy it now. Pretty clear quartz. Got some rainbow action in there. Right there. Number two is another clear quartz. Really pretty. A lot to look at in there. And then number three is an angel aura quartz. This is a clear quartz that's been treated with uh, the aura coating. As you can see, it has that iridescent effect. And this is number three, also $10. Hey, casual. So that's number three. So those guys are 10 if anyone's interested. Two clear quartz and an angel aura. And that was my three. Number three. You want the angel aura, Michelle? Oh, Patty came in first, I'm sorry. Patty, thank you, Patty. Which one were you interested in? Patty came just before Michelle, one sec. Thank you, ladies. Okay, Patty wanted the aura. Sorry, Michelle. Michelle, would you still like number two? Thank you, Patty. Okay, thank you, Michelle. 
Thank you, ladies. Oh, we can't hear you, Lucid. Oh no, my mouse wasn't working. Okay, <laughs> um, this is a purchase that nobody paid for. Um, so if you've seen this before, if you recognize it, um, this is a butterfly skull necklace. It looks better on this lighter thing, but I'm having issues getting it to stand. And it's got a little skull. It's gunmetal tone. And it's got an extendable clasp. And so there's that. What was your start? Eight dollars. Um, Um, I also have this. Don't go anywhere, because right after Lucid's turn, we're doing another giveaway. This 925, it's a, a pendant and also a pin, sterling silver. And it's going to be a $15 start. It's, um, let's see. I want to say two and three quarter inches by two inches. Go away, light. You mess everything up. Yeah, they were fighting over that skull butterfly. Oh, did Carol, somebody bid on it? Oh, cool. I can't see chat. Um, and it's got some other markings on it as well. But I think it's, uh, I don't know what, I can't make out the other markings. Okay. And then I have... Um, this is another thing that sold and didn't get paid for is a pair of these um, flamingo frames. I can model them for you if you'd like. They're amazing. They look like this. And I'm going to start these out at I'm gonna put them back on their pedestal of items in the thing. The 15 was the, is what you had on the sterling, right? Yeah. I'm guessing you sell that one for Maury, the sterling silver. Maury got the sterling, and it was okay. And then the butterfly necklace. 
that good to you? Um, I'm not sure. Okay, so Carol got the butterfly. Morty put 15, I'm guessing, for the sterling paint squirrel. And then um, Carolina Lady is five on the glasses. We can go ahead and sell it to her. And I think thank everybody for their thanks. Was that three? Yeah. Okay. All right. So first off, we're gonna do a giveaway. Um, I don't know what it's gonna be. Do you guys want? You. Uh, I'll give away this brooch. It's a gold tone brooch. It says love, and it's a heart. And just to remind everyone, um, you can only be eligible for the giveaway if you have an order with me or you plan on um, having one before the end of the month, which is tomorrow. So if you want this cute little brooch, type in gold, G-O-L-D. Gold. Did you get that? Maria said, bill her and send it to Michelle. Uh, I got Carol first. Is that what you guys got too? Yes. Go ahead, Carol. All right. Congratulations to Carol. Okay. So. Uh, for round one, everything is $3, and I'm going to number it. It is going to be by it now. If you want any of it, just put a number in the chat for me. Number one, I have two of, so two people can put in number one. This is cobalt blue glass. It is uh, like a thicker glass, and it is a heart-shaped bud vase. Sure thing, Carol. That's number one. Number two is this uh, smaller cobalt blue glass vase. These are all $3. Number three is gonna be this little porcelain box with these beautiful flowers on top. Little trinket dish here. That was number three. Number four is gonna be this little pottery bud vase. And number five is this Avon egg with two robins in it. Um, what is your start for choice? Uh, it's just $3, and then you just put in the number that you want. It's all by it now. All right. So I got Carmen for the box. Yep. I'm sorry, my stream yard is acting up tonight a little bit, so I was laggy like that. That's all right. So I saw I've got the blue cobalt, the blue cobalt heart vases, this blue vase, the little pottery bud vase, and the Avon. Any interest in any of that stuff? Oh my gosh, stop trying to fall and break me. B said the cobalt base, please. Number two. This one. Yeah. And casual flipper said blue base, please. And casual flipper also said Avon egg. 
Okay, so the other blue vase is gone. I do have the dark cobalt blue heart shape vases, and there are two of those available. Well, let me know if that's what you meant. And then I got you down for the Avon egg for Shorzies. Holy guacamole. Can Joanne would like the pottery thing? Joanne? What's pottery things? Press your lavender button. Thank you, lovely. PNB said sorry, number three instead of number three. This was number three, wasn't it? This one? I don't have them in order on the thing anymore. Okay. Um, go ahead and let us know if you wanted the clear, um, more clear cobalt glass or the frosty heart cobalt. Yes. PNB said yes, that one, please. All right, cool. So I got clear. it. Okay. I got you. Okay. Let's just do some clothes. Hey, Humble Barn. This is going to be a $2 start choice. This one is an extra large. It is a little faded. It is a black scorch by NYL. Black fabric mm -hmm. scorch. $2 start choice. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Short. <laughs> <laughs> I just saw that come through too. I was like, wait, no. So this will be number one. Yeah, he's a Dorcas. I had to leave and come back, otherwise I won't be able to hear you guys. All right, off to number two is by Pardo Cry. It's an extra, extra large ensemble in Mexico. Um, it's kind of like a swim cover up is what it looks like to me. It's yellow, blue, and green quite long it's got little slits on the side it goes to my knee this will be number two <clears throat> so the highest bidder gets to pick their uh pick what they want first hey cha cha Oh, Jonathan, just come in the room. Please. Anything else that I can put in there? Okay, no Carol's still in it too. Um, we can do this one. So, option number three is no boundaries. It's an extra, extra large. It is a black cold sh shoulder. No, it's not. It is a tank. The black tank says extra, extra large. It's actually pretty cute. Um, it's great. got some cactuses on it. Yeah, this would definitely fit me. I probably should have kept this one. So this will be option three. Okay. Uh, number four can be this one. I don't know the brand or the size. It looks like a double XL. It is a gray um tank with little arrows on it okay i got four options okay so just four options and it looks like or do you are you gonna put five options uh oh we can do five this will be the fifth one no boundaries extra extra large another tank this is a sunset 
Beach. What's that beach? All right, those are all your options. And it was a two dollar start. Have we gotten past yeah. two dollars? No. Carol is in for two. I haven't seen anybody else. I don't know why nobody's putting in more than two, but um, yeah. So far, it's just Carol. All right, Carol's in a two. Does anybody want to come in at three? I'll show you your options again, and the winner gets to pick what they want. So number one are, is the squirt, the black squirt. There's Lucid. Number two is this, like, swim cover-up. Number three is this uh, 2X cactus tank. Number four is this gray tank. And number five is the black sunset one. Okay, and if there's nobody else interested in that choice, um, Carol, which one do you want? And then uh, Casual was passing on these, right? Um, <laughs> Oh, it's just a little too small. <sighs> it almost fits. I'm gonna have to look in the mirror. All right, what does she want? Uh, which, oh, Carol said one, three, and five, please. Um, of course you picked the tank I was going to keep. <laughs> Freaking brat. All right. right. Anything left. That leaves us the gray tank. And the 2X swim cover. If anyone wants those, put tank, put tank or cover. There's just that gray tank with the arrows and that swimsuit cover. Casual. Or did you mean from the previous, the bases and stuff? <clears throat> My third item, this is from Nine and Co. It is a purse. It is a black and white tweed. Oh my god. Black and red tweed. It's a cute little handbag. And this one is going to be an $8 start. That is gorgeous. Seriously gorgeous. It has a very trip feel to it. I think it, that's what it was, isn't it? I don't know. I don't think my mom ever used it. If she did, she didn't use it very much. The ones that used to be sold at Hot Topic, that type of feel to me. Pass on the first. It looks good. Just a few pull, uh, pulled threads, pulled threads here and there. And then we got some minor cracking right here on that front pocket. All right. Let me know if whoopsie if anyone's interested. I'm here, sorry. 
All right, I'm going to show some more towers. These are $16 choice. 16 choice. I have a lot of $16 towers, so I'm going to show them in groups. So we'll start with these five. Again, these are 16, your choice. Number one is Green Aventurine. Pretty sagey green color. Green Aventurine. Number two is Rhodonite. Love Rhodonite. Looks like, uh, reminds me of like a Tim Burton movie. Oh no, it looks like they're looking for trees. Yes, like all just branches mm -hmm. over a pretty pink sky. Look at that. Very Halloween like. Number oh, three. I need more towers, but can't afford what? it. What? I said I need more towers, but can't afford it right now. Oh. Number three is uh, Sunstone. That has some really nice color to it too. Yeah, really cool banding with the quartz in there. Really cool. Okay, so Patty Claus is in for 16. All right, thank you, Patty. And the last two are uh, natural highlights. This is number four, this guy here. Number four is natural highlight. And number five is also natural highlight. And this is the one that has a little uh, window quartz near the top. I'll show you this one. Oh, well, not really too prominent, but it's got a cute little quartzy area there. So yep, yeah, those five. Patty, which one were you interested in? You came in first. Yeah. Venturine, Rhodonite, Sunstone, or one of the natural highlights. Where'd Lucid go again? I don't know. <laughs> Michelle P, ask where Lucid went. I didn't skip her, did I? Rodanite, you got it. Thank you. I'll be looking for that later on when I can afford it. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any more, Christy. I can try to get some more, though. Keep you in mind. Yeah, and then, so Maria, which one were you interested in? If you were interested in these ones that were left, we got Green Aventurine, Sunstone, and Natural Highlights. I know, right, Maria? I'm super jealous. What's the first and second one, Gina? Patty, or Pat, the first one is Green Aventurine. Beautiful, sagey green color. And that one's a good one to have. Patty already nabbed number two. That was Rhodonite. Rhodonite. Patty took it. Okay, no problem. <laughs> All right, if anyone's interested in these remaining $16 ones, just let me know. And I'm gonna move on to the second batch of $16 ones. Again, these are choice, 16. I'm getting your list, Gina. <laughs> yes, Patty. <laughs> it's, it's, it sucks because this is like my first garden year and I'm gonna be so nervous about like, when I bring everything outside. All right. Number one is from, Fuch I think this is Fuchsite. Fuch Fuchsite or Zoocyte? Now I can't even remember. Yeah, it looks like All right, I can't tell. Does this white jacket look good on me or not? I think it's Zoocyte. That looks cute, Miranda. It does look cute. Yeah. Does it fit you? Is it a little tight around? 
I mean, from here it looks cute. It's like tight and not tight at the same time. <laughs> is that a good tight? <laughs> well, like I, because like I can get it on and it's comfortable, which is usually pretty hard with me in jackets, because like I've got wider, I've got wider shoulders, but it fits and I can move mm -hmm. around and stuff, and I can like fully button it if I like if I had to. I like it. I guess it's mine now. <laughs> So one is zoocyte, zoocyte. It's got cute little patches on it too. It is I need cute. to start doing like an outfit of the day again. <laughs> Number two is a fire quartz. I'm pretty sure I gave that to my mom. Man, what's up with this lighting? Here, it's a little better. Number two is fire quartz. Fire quartz. Fire quartz. And number three is fire quartz. Yeah, I love Road Knight too. It's really cool. Okay. Number three is a beautiful fire quartz. And then four and five, this is number four. This is phantom fluorite. Green phantom fluorite. Cool stone. You can often see little chunks of the fluoride in there. That's number four, and the number five is a phantom fluorite. Those big chunkies in there, pretty cool. Pretty green color. I'm gonna go grab the rest of the clothes from my uh, from my garage. Just keep showing. Okay. Phantom fluorite. So those guys are sixteen. If anyone's interested, again, so a site. Two fire quartz. Those are really pretty. And phantom fluorite, which are super cool too. Which you don't see too often. All right. And then third item, I have rose quartz. Oh, Patty's in a 16. Patty, which one were you interested in? Hey, Jennifer. All right, good choice, Patty. There it is. Good choice on the phantom fluorite. Thank you. And then Pat, one sec. Thank you, Patty. Sorry, I like to label these right away because I don't want to get anything mixed up. And then Pat, number three. Great choice, fire quartz. That one is yours, thank you. Thank you, ladies. Whichever is prettier, let's see. I like the one you picked. You can kind of see through it a little better. The other one is more cloudy at the, at the bottom. I like the one that you picked. I would go with that one. Thank you. All right, three more of these $16 ones left if anyone's interested. And then I have some rose quartz towers. These range, I'm so sorry, Christy. They're like four different prices. <laughs> um, they're 10, 12, 15, 16. I can even just put in the numbers for you quick there. That's what they are. They're rose quartz towers. Buy it now. And there's one of each of the price. Hey, Maria. Oh, Maria. Um, I showed some $16 towers. 
some more $16 towers. These three are left. Zoysite, Fire Quartz, and Phantom Fluorite. All right, I'm back. And now I'm showing uh, Rose Quartz. Did we find Lucid? What? Did we find Lucid? No, I don't know where she is. Did she write in the chat? No, nope, Michelle's looking for her. Maybe what the hell? You said her something died earlier. Maybe she's having computer problems again. Remember she said her computer died? Mm-hmm. All right, well. This guy's 10. Rose Quartz. We have a $12 one. Hey, Jen. Oh, no, Maria. Why are you confused? Here's the $15 one. Oh, that's too tight. That's not good. That one has a little, like, internal cracky bit looking thing there at the bottom. And then number 16, number 16, number four is a $16 one. <laughs> oh, oh. Damn. Okay, Patty. Oh, that's very sweet of you. Maria, Patty wants you to pick out, I'm guessing, a rose quartz tower, and she wants to pay for it. Uh, Jen wants a rose quartz tower. $10 rose quartz for me. Thank you, Jennifer. Well, now you're upside down. What are you doing? Calm down. Hi. Hi. Are you smelling my mom? Do you miss my mom or something? Get out of here. Scram. Scram. Of the last one, Patty. Hey, guess who has thin mints? Thin mints. Thin mints. <laughs> yeah, girls got cookies. Maria, these are all sixteen dollar ones that I just showed previously. We have natural highlight. Patty wants you to pick one. <laughs> Green Venturine. Sunstone. Phantom Fluorite. Green Phantom Fluorite. Fire Quartz. <laughs> And a zoocyte, which is green and black. It has some flashy bits in there. So, Maria, did any of those tickle your fancy? Whoops. I really um, want to drop things. Done. <laughs> cool. Well, thank you. The last one. Good choice. So, sorry. Thank you, Patty. That was very sweet of you. Hi. Wow, my arms are going way too much when I did that. So, I just found some LuLaRoe leggings. I did. Oh, boy. This is going to be a choice with an $8 <laughs> start. Hello, Babette. You have found me. And Gina. She's here, too. There she is. Hey, Babette. You made it. <laughs> so as my dog walks in. So it's an $8 start choice. The highest bidder gets to pick which one or ones they want. I believe these are all size tall and curvy. Um, yep, number one is at least tall and curvy. These are red with a deeper red heart print on them. That'll be option number one. I've got more LuLaRoe clothes somewhere. I just don't know where they are, man. <sighs> number two is black with from Septicon. Septicon. Septa. What's six sides? A sexton? 
<laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> Sectagon. I don't know. Is it a Sectagon? Sectus. Septicons. I don't know. <laughs> We're in Transformers now. We're fighting the Septicons. Let's go. That's option number two. This is an eight dollar start. Choice. I think Hexagon's five, isn't it? Hello? What are you doing over there? Why are you making it sound like there's someone walking around upstairs? Don't do that. Go lay down. Hey Jennifer. Make me grab my freaking bat. All right, and then this one's tall and curvy too. So option number three is black, and it's like orange and yellow, wavy bits. A pentagon is five. A stop sign. It is. It's a hexagon. Hexagon is six. Okay. And a pen. A pentagon is no. A hexagon is six, and a pentagon is five. What seven? Oh. Show us your math skills, baby. Oh, that seven? must be a septagon. I know there's like eight. It's an octagon. octagon is eight. Yeah. We got octagon because of octo mama. No. <laughs> <laughs> was, it, was it $8? Like choice for those? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's choice. Yeah. Jennifer's in an eight. All right. I can take them off my head. Anybody want to go to nine? Well, thanks, Patty. Sometimes I try. Sometimes I definitely don't try. Polygon is seven? No. Really? Seven is non-existent. That is false. You can have a seven-sided seven, seven -sided thingy. Hep a hepticon? You go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's just a weird shape. Am I smarter than a third grader? Nope. <laughs> Is it a heptagon? Who thought of these names? What is wrong with them? If it has seven sides, it is a heptagon. I'm sure it has to do with another language. What's a, speak. What's a heptopus? Does a heptopus exist? An, oct an octopus with seven legs? Would you call it a septopus? Is that what we call it, an octopus? Because it has eight arms or eight legs? That's why it's an octi. <laughs> Whatever, man. I know, I know, I'm sorry. Whatever. All right. So, Jennifer did come in at eight. Does anybody want to come in at nine? They are all tall and curvy. The curve. Tall and curve. So, this yeah. one was number three. Number two <laughs> is what started this com conversation. This one. This is option two. And then option number one is red with hearts. I'm like average. I'm like I'm like average height and fat. <laughs> I wish I could say I'm I'm tall and curvy. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm short and round. Right? You are Miranda. Miranda, Miranda, you have a nice shape. You do. You're really proportionate and you're curvy. I'm like oh, very <laughs> like flat chested. It's fine. Yeah, it's great. The good time over here, Miranda. No, I don't like I don't hate my body by any means. I love myself. But I'm definitely chunky. All right, Jennifer, I got you. You got one and two. It's yours. If anybody wants number three, it's eight bucks. Let me know. I only take a million years to uh, to work, to go. My turn. It's fine. All right, write this down. Two pairs of blue little legs. I'm, I'm, just, I'm, legging I'm just tall and fat. <laughs> I, I don't like things that cling to the legs. I'm like old school, don't they? You guys are making my knee spaz out. All right, let's go. Let's do some more some more shiitake mushrooms over here, huh? This is a plate bowl. It's stainless steel Japan. It was six bucks. Right now, you can have it for three dollars. It is in the shape of a leaf. Stainless steel leaf tray. 
three bucks. Put you some jewelry on it. Put you some stones in there. Maybe you want to be fancy, and that's the bowl you want to eat your jelly beans out of. I'm not judging you. Do what you want. And for my last item, because I like to take all year and then half of next year, this is pink glass. I think it's a depression glass. I don't really know what makes it depression glass. When I look at it, I'm not depressed, so it's definitely not that. And it does have a tinge of pink. It is a flower shaped. It was 12 bucks. Right now, you can have it for $8. Also, you could put jelly beans in this, or stones, or jewelry, or chips and dip, or lots of soap. If you really like soap, you can put three bars of soap in there, or the little fancy soaps that you want to eat, but you can't because they're not good for you. And uh, it's also older glass because it's got bubbles in it. It's got the bubbles. Pete, Patty. I don't know what kind of flower it is. I am not a flowerologist. <laughs> Shit. It's not a herbologist. Is it bot botany? I'm not a botanist. Okay, but how am I, fairy, how am I supposed to know it was made during the Great Depression? I wasn't alive then. <laughs> I don't even know what year it happened. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. I feel really dumb. All right, Patty, you got the Japan stainless steel. It's yours. Anybody want this $8 pink hib hibiscus maybe glass thing? And don't go anywhere because I'm going to do another giveaway in roughly 15 minutes. Whenever Gina gets done with her time. Okay. If you want this, let me know. $8. Is fairy legally blind blind? I don't know. I don't think so. I feel like I'm legally blind, but I'm not. All right, I have some $14 towers to show. $14 choice. There are six total, and three of them are red hematoid quartz. This is number one. Again, these are 14. Number one is a red hematoid quartz. Not to be confused with the fire quartz. Hey, Babette, subscribe! Ooh, buddy! Sorry. <laughs> Number two, red hematoid quartz. Yes, Carol. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody ever matches my energy. What the am I supposed to do over here, huh? <laughs> I'm acting like a fool and nobody cares. No, you're not. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is number three. Red hematoid quartz. Gina tells me what to do. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, no. Number four is black, black obsidian. Four is just a black obsidian. Number five is strawberry quartz. The last one I have. Strawberry quartz. Has some sparkly bits in there as usual. And then the last one, number six, is a pink tourmaline. You like this one too? I said, I like it like that. Damn it, it's your gimmick. Well, it's going to be 14 if anyone's interested. Maury! Hi, love. Keep <laughs> be being you. Oh, Maury would like the strawberry quartz. Thank you, Maury. And Fairy said, Miranda, we love you. You fool! I like reading out the chat for people. I need to be one of those, you know those people who just like read comments on like other people's like videos and like things like that? I really think that might be something I was born to do. <laughs> that would be funny, yes. <laughs> I need to do it. I would watch that, that sounds entertaining. <laughs> Maybe that's what I'll do for my TikToks. It's like, wanna do TikTok, but I feel like, <laughs> I don't want to just go on there and be like, 
Uh, today I got Ocean Jasper Towers in, and I'm going to tell you about him. <laughs> Not really. I'm going to show you, and then I'm going to leave and take a nap. <laughs> I'm not like I'm not a very informative channel. <laughs> I am sometimes. Sometimes we have like really good, you know, conversations and stuff. What are those? Yeah, yeah totally. are those? these are lapis lazuli boots. <laughs> yes, thank you, Mari. No way. The green tower that wasn't crochet. Which green tower, Patty? <sighs> These are lapis lazuli boots, and these are six dollar. Buy it now if anyone's interested. Your choice. <laughs> six dollars. They have a good amount of pyrite in them too. Or if you want the pair, ten dollars. If you want one, put six. If you want both, put ten. Jonathan. <laughs> oh, Patty, I don't have a ruby. A ruby. Um. Oh my goodness, what is the other one? Zoocyte and. You shade, you shade. Yeah, no, that's def definitely zoocyte. It's a darker green with a black. It's just missing the ruby. So it's just plain zoocyte. Yeah, this is this is just plain zoocyte because it doesn't have any ruby in it at all. So it's just zoocyte. And the fuchsia, like a lighter green that you often see with the ruby in it too. Sometimes ruby can ruby grows in like both of those stones. There's a reason that they call Ruby like the slut of stones. It just likes to get up in everyone's business. <laughs> you whore. <laughs> Ruby's such a whore. So yeah, these guys, if anyone's interested, just let me know. <laughs> the lighter one? This looks this looks like green aventurine. This is the other one I showed that was green. Hey, how'd you get up here? And then this one is um, phantom fluorite. That I'm that I'm positive. Those are the green ones that I showed tonight, Patty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then my third item. Did she say she wanted a ruby zoisite tower? Do you have one? I only have one left. He's $20, though, which is why everyone's kind of been like, you know. Oh, I'm gonna, I'll show the bird next. This guy is $22. Buy it now. So it's an amethyst cluster, right? It stands like this. Pretty cool. But it's got a hole at the top. And it's got this stone bird, which I believe is made of calcite. And um, you put him in the hole, and he sits on top of the cluster. I love that guy. Oh, the phantom. The phantom is 16, Patty. Look how cute that bird is. The phantom is. fluoride is 16. And the bird is 22. Those are the links in the chat. Do you want to come in and entertain us with your with your verbiage? Ow. This guy is $22. Bird comes out and you can put it in and out of the hole there on top. And you can sort of swivel it too how you want to display him. It kind of goes as far back as that, to the side, a little to the front. Oh, it's a Hi, Mari. All right, Patty, this one's yours. Thank you. Mm. 
it to the window, to the world, till the sweat drips down Gina's balls. Oh, everybody's crying. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Patty. <laughs> Wow. wow. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta just ignore me. I don't know where I was going. <laughs> hey, buddy, you want some trash? Here you go. Oh. That was my three. Patty, if you were interested in the phantom fluorite, just let me know. Yep, yeah, Patty. And I still have the boots. <laughs> All right, we're four minutes early, but we're going to do a giveaway. Anyways, this is going to be a double doozy twofer. That means two people are going to win. I only have two worry stones left. I got a bro. I got a green adventuring. It's in the shape of an oval. And I have a rose quartz. It's in the shape of a heart. These are going to be your options. Okay. <clears throat> Let me think of something funny. Probably not. Listen. Uh, the first one who types booger. The first two people who type booger. The first one gets to pick which one they want, and then the runner-up gets the other. <laughs> Go! Wow. <laughs> That's all I can think of. Oh, hi, buddy. Get out of here. Go on. Scram. Hey, I'm a little girl, okay? Boogers are funny. Boogie, 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 boogie. <laughs> all right, what do we got? We have Booger, and then we have Bugger. Looks like I got... Carol and Rise Carol Up. Carol and Rise Up. Carol, you're number one, baby. You want Rose Quartz or Green Adventurine? You want a heart or you want an oval? You want my heart? Too late, you already got it. I just kidding. <laughs> I thought that'd be a lot smoother than it was. And then this is the Ruby Zoysite Tower I have. It is 20, and it does have a good amount of Ruby on there, if I can. That is so pretty. And what did you do to your nails? Don't ask me, okay? I painted them <laughs> with Sharpies and stuff. Oh, you're bored then, right? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> okay. All right, so what was the verdict? <laughs> the green one? All right, rise up. That means you you have my heart now. Carol didn't want it. Don't throw my heart away, man. Someone tell Terry that she's way lagging. Carol. Bro. <laughs> you best believe I'm going to forget who this, run this belongs to. Can you read that? Does that look like Carol to you? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. I'm horrible. This is a slew. Rise Up gave my heart away. Aw. What did I just tell you not to do? Hi, Terry again. So rude. You didn't want my heart. Hi, Quintia. Very sweet. Yeah, yeah. You wouldn't think it was sweet if it was your heart being given away. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was very nice of you. Michelle or her daughter will love it. Dante, get out of here. Go. Scram. I can't do anything with you guys up in my grill like this, man. This is a slew, a train of $10 stone towers. I'm going to show you and number them. Pay close attention. Number one is yellow adventurine or orange adventurine. Number two is also yellow adventurine. It looks like a popsicle. Yeah, it's cool, right? Number three is pink tourmaline. It's a short fatty. But it's so cute. Number four. Number four is, I think this is called Africa Stripe. Ooh, I like that. That reminds me of the, uh, like the painted film. One, two, three, four. Number five, we're just going to call this Unikite because we don't know what it is. It looks like a Unikite. Yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> 
Um, number six is Dragon Blood. I can see you, Carol. That's okay. All right, number seven, Amethyst. These are all $10. Number eight, this one's a little bit fatter. Number nine is also amethyst, and this one is significantly smaller. This is a little baby. How much were the bigger ones? Were they ten dollars too or no? Yep, everything I'm showing is ten bucks. And then number ten, this is striped fluorite, blue and purple and green. It's kind of it's rainbow fluorite, but I don't think it has all of them. And it is just to buy it now. You just tell me what number you want. And then we have number eleven. And last that, one, number 12. That one looks like, they, that one too, really. It looks like they just took a big old chunk out of the ocean. It's, they're pretty, yeah, they're pretty cool. <laughs> I quite like them. And when you shine lights at them, they look even prettier. All right, P&B is taking number one. And then she the needs a popsicle in her life. Uh, is number two orange or yellow? Um, it's like a yellowish orange. Number one and number two um, are the same color. Okay. It's. GMB says number 10. Um, Babette, which one do you want? Since you're next. I don't. It's like a. It's, it's yellow. It's, it's like a solid puppet. <laughs> it makes me want orange puppet. I mean, there it is compared to my, my, my thing. I think Babette won in number 10. Oh. Oh. Okay. So that one I just showed was number two. Babette, just type confirm if number 10 is the one you wanted, and that is this one. We'll just make sure you meant this one. Uh, Babette wanted number 10, but she led, She said Patty wants it to let her. It's all right. There's two other striped ones, too. And we can all share. B said Babette can have number 10. It's fine. And Carol wants number 10. All right. I'm giving Babette number 10, and then I'll show... Number 11 and 12 again. These are the other two striped ones that I have. This one is the biggest of them. And then here's the last one, which is number 12. That one almost looks like it has, it's so close to purple in some of it. Oh yeah, it's got per it's most these are mostly purple and blue and then like a little bit of green. So that was eleven and twelve again in case um you wanted that one. Or either one of those. All right. So we're passing on all the amethyst, the unikite, the Africa stripe, the pink tourmaline, and the dragon bloodstone, correct? Oh PMB says so take eleven. Thank you, Maria. And eleven. Aw, Jonathan. That's cute. Uh, how do you want me to do that, though? You just want me to do, like, write the first two people that say, I want a stone? <laughs> yes, 11 is taken by that. Yep. Number 11 is gone. All right, I'm going to show them again. The first two people who say yes will get um, a free tower, courtesy of Mr. Roseberry. So much sweetness going on. I know, right? Get in the cavity. Very sweet of you, Jonathan. Mm -hmm. right, I'm going to renumber these. Number one. Number two.
Number three. Number four. And number five. And then six, seven, and eight are all amethyst. So six. Um, so said one, two, and three, yes. Hey, Sandy. Hey, Sandy. And eight. Do you want Venmo or Cash App or what? Um, I don't have a Venmo, and I don't know if you remember my Cash App. If it's easier just to PayPal me, that's fine. Um, number four is Dragon Bloodstone. No, Mr. American, they're not. Okay, so who said? So I got Fairy and Patty in for yes first. And then P and B, were you trying to claim the pink tourmaline? No, you did not just buy all of these. <laughs> I mean, I can make you buy them all if you want. Oh, y'all are stressing me out. All right, Fairy, let me know which one you want. And then Patty, let me know which one you want. And Jonathan's only given two away for free. So it's only those two people. All right, all right, PMB. So Patty, Paws, and Fairy, tell me what you want. Okay, thank you, Mary. Good Lord. And then Patty Paws, let me know what you want. Thank you, Jonathan. i stressing everybody out over here. Fairy blue strip fluorite and Patty. Can we see again? Yeah, there's a lot. Um, what was what was Denise's comment? Hang on, Sandy. We're doing a. Uh, Jonathan bought two towers, so. And he's giving them away. So here's number one, which is pink tourmaline. Number two is Africa Stripe. Number three is Unicorn which is on the ground, no? Number three. Number Number four is Dragon Bloodstone. And the only thing I saw from Denise was I love everything. Talking to you. Number five is gone and sold. So we have number six. Number seven and number eight. And number five went to fairy. Oh gosh, look at all those different parts. All right, Patty Prize. Tell me more, tell me more. Does he hold your hand? I don't remember that song at all. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's no great. Uh huh. Yeah, she did show us. Number one. Powers. All right. Number one. All right. Does any know? Does anybody want anything else? Uh, the only things that are left now is all three of the amethyst chunks, um, the stripe, unikite, and then dragon blood. If you want any of those, just tell me the name of them in the chat, and that'll work. Um, Babette, I usually use Square um, to invoice, and it just the invoice goes to your email, and then you pay with like your card. And if you have your Google Pay linked to PayPal, then you can pay through PayPal. Or I can use PayPal. I just very much prefer Square. I think I sent you an invoice, but I don't remember if I invoiced you through PayPal 
That way I didn't confuse you or if I invoiced you through Square. So I will invoice you. Um, he just wanted to send me the money now because he's a dork, I guess. Anyways, Jonathan, uh, Fairy and Patty pause one. All right, for my third item, now that I've taken a thousand million gajillion years, it's just a choice between these two. These are honey calcite chunks. They are $12. This is number one. And then this one is number two. And then the email that it'll come through is um, the Rehomer Miranda. Number five doesn't exist anymore, Sandy. How much would you start for the calcite? Uh, they're just $12 by it now. That was one and two. And then all the towers are $10. Maury, you'll take number one. For the chunks, the chunky babies. And then if you've never heard of Square, it's called... Uh, they call it Square, Squarespace, Square something. Um, it's a huge um, like platform. It's what a lot of businesses use to like invoice people and to get paid. It is used by like what well, probably millions of people. Probably millions of people use it, and it's used especially in like a lot of small businesses, like a lot of businesses around here. Um, whether it's like the donut shop or like the thrift store or whatever, they all use Square. And I actually have a Square like reader thing like for my phone that I can like take cards on and stuff. It's really cool. If you've never heard of it, I said you can Google it if you want. Make yourself more comfortable with it. Um, really cool device. It's fantastic. Much prefer it over PayPal. <laughs> PayPal sucks a bag of dookie dongs. Anyways. All right. <laughs> She's like, I left and did laundry now. Okay. <laughs> it is not so... Oh my god, you guys are so annoying. It is honey calcite. Alright, I'm gonna throw Gina back up. If anybody wanted any of those towers or the other calcite junk, just let me know. Alright, I have a gorgeous smoky quartz tower. This guy is a 32 starting bed. 32 starting bid for this big, chunky, gorgeous, smoky quartz. 32 start. And it's full of rainbows. See all that? Oh, it's so gorgeous. Thank you, Michelle. Thing is so pretty. Yeah, what happened to Lucid? I was wondering that too. It is a fatty. <laughs> I don't know. She just disappeared. She didn't say anything in the chat either, so I don't I don't know what happened. It's an inch and a half thick. It's a chunky boy and four inches tall.
Well, if there's no other interest, we can call it to Michelle. It is fat. <laughs> it's look at those rainbows. It is just stunning. I'm sad to see it go. I almost didn't show it again. I was just gonna keep it on my table. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle, you are going to love it. We can start calling to Michelle if there's no other interest. All right, thank you, Michelle. Why, why did you make me just think of Baby Got Back, Michelle? Thank you. I can't wait to see what you think of that. <laughs> So pretty. It's a chunker. All right, my second out, second album. I've, I'm a, I'm a musician, and you know, my second album, <laughs> my second item. <laughs> oh, we have this beautiful blue agate slice. I can't believe you hid that from us for this long. <laughs> Like that's a long time, man. You you this is your yeah, second yeah. album? You you the hit the album was released soon, yeah. yeah. You missed the yeah. first one? Yeah. I did miss the first one. <laughs> no, I'm upset. <laughs> <laughs> Let's drink the second. Forget about the first one. Yeah. This is gonna be a twelve dollar start. Twelve dollar start on a really pretty blue agate slice. So oh, Patty. <laughs> I know how that is. Your body says one thing and your head says something else. This is me, it's my body and my head. <laughs> oh, death metal, Michelle. Yep, death metal. <laughs> of I growl. It to be. I have to have some kind of melodic death metal in there somewhere. <laughs> Carol, I do have two $10 purple fluorite towers. Yep, I still have those. These guys are 10 Well, thank you. Really, Karen, will solo cup fit on that? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> those are the fluorite towers. Okay. Are those twelve two or are those different? Oh, showing Carol. She asked if I had the ten dollar fluorite towers, and these are them. Okay. Well, you got Karen in at twelve, and then Joanne came in at twelve, so. Okay, yeah. Karen came in first, so style with Pat, you'd have to come in at 13. Wow. Night, Joanne. This is a coaster. Oh, can you fit a solo cup on it? Um, yeah, it probably would just fit. Definitely. If you're using it as a coaster. 
the middle almost looks furry inside. It's really cool. I didn't even notice this. I don't know if you can see the furry looking center. Good night, Joanne. Love you. Mwah. Bow with Pat is in the 15th. You guys can just call her Pat, you know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I usually do. I don't know why I said Pat, but I did. There's a lot. That's why I said style by You said it all weird, Gina. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> what? Will we talk about the fuzzy center? Yeah, did you see the kind of fuzzy looking center? I tried to show yeah. it. It almost looks like shag carpet in the center. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no. It looks like a loose sponge in the middle. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> it looks very porous inside of there. <laughs> yep, yep. Uh, Karen's cool. in a 14 now. Okay. Thanks, ladies. And the back is like the underside of the, the loofah. <laughs> <laughs> really, really solid side. And then the other side's like, I got some little. Right? It looks like 3D uh, inside of there. Yeah, basically. Pat's in at 15. Oh, I'm not bidding it. I'm not bidding it. I'm not bidding it. It does look really cool. I love the layers it shows. Yeah. Really pretty. You know what you could use that for? If you, have animals, if you have animals around, you can put that on the top of your cup or whatever you're drinking out of. Just make sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> For protection. Uh, Karen said it's okay. I'm going to make a pretty. Oh, that's good. Yes. Power stand. That would be really cool. I didn't show this guy. This guy's 10 if anyone's interested. It's a Chevron Amethyst. Pass out. So Karen's in at 16. And Jonathan, anyway? Hi, crap. Okay, Jonathan oh, is at 20. Power bid. Power bid at 20. And I have the smoky quartz power. Pat's it. Pat, um, Michelle already bought it. Are you lagging? <laughs> oh, yep, that was already nabbed. <laughs> Yeah, I got this little chunker of a chevron amethyst. This guy's 10. Patty, pause if you feel like getting another chunker. <laughs> it's cute. It has a lot of darkness in that. This would look really pretty, too, just sitting on, like, a plate stand to display it. Yes. And or up against the window sill. Chunker's yours, Patty. <laughs> Oh yeah, okay, she wants this chevron. And I guess Jonathan gets the like because he did a power bit at Bonnie. Everybody else I knows. I think he wants a fancy coaster. I think that's it. Is that what you want for Jonathan? Are we gonna see pictures of on camera <laughs> Right, next time we see him on video, he's going to hold up his fancy coaster. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay, sold to Jonathan for 20. And well, thank you, Jonathan. Chevron is Patty. Yep, Chevron sold to Patty. Thank you, guys. 
<laughs> Thank you for your bed. Thank you. Was that my second or third? I don't remember. Everything is a coaster. <laughs> wow. Well, okay, I showed the smoky really really and then that. Okay, I think I got one more actually. She needs to find a sugar daddy to buy her a bigger house for all of her stuff. Yeah, this would make a gorgeous uh, sun catcher. If you want um, to drill a hole in it. Oh. It's wherever you put your beer down. <laughs> Um, okay, I guess I can do this beautiful lab palm stone. Um, I'll do it as a bid because it has some beautiful flash and we can start it at uh, $7. It has a beautiful blue flash. $7 start. And I can only show it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Duh. No crown, that's the strong stuff, right? <laughs> All right, I think that's the one side. It has some strong blue right there, but the other side I know has more. Where is it? Oh, there we go. Look at that. That does look like dramatic. Yeah, that's really blue. Yeah. Really pretty. Really blue, almost purple. Yeah. Really yes, it's full of magic. <laughs> Oh, my lighting. So sorry. On that one side. I literally have a light right here, and it's like casting a dark shadow. I do not understand. I don't get it. A box light. <laughs> it's almost like a violet blue. Look at that. Oh, it's so pretty. Hi, Kara. Yes, very rich blue. So yeah, this guy's a starting bit of seven if anyone's interested. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, well, that was my three. Is that my phone going off or your guys? Let's take care. I installed Messenger on my laptop, so it's making noises. I'm sorry. <laughs> how dare you? You're out how to silence it. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not super worried about it. I'm just trying to get this package before I forget who it belongs to. There we go. Mute notification. Girl says seven. She wants the lab stone. <clears throat> Carol, you got it. Thank you. What was your three? Is KF2 Kara? Kara. Kara, okay. We, we discovered it's Kara. Okay. I've got some more clothes. I'm just going to do a quick round of clothes this time. This is Harry Potter, size extra large. This is a, again, like a sweater um, dress kind of thing, except for this time it isn't a size extra large. This is a $10 start. And this one, again, a couple of inches above my knee, and it says 
Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, and Ravenclaws. Got all four of them. Where the last one was just Gryffindor. Short sleeve. Like a half sleeve is what it looks like. And then the back doesn't have anything. Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, Harry Potter. <laughs> Sorry. Are you a potter head? Pats in a ten. Anybody want to come in at eleven? Here is that. I did not want anything, Gina. I was asking what your three were. Hey, hey. All right, give it to Pat if no one else is into it. Is it cotton? It doesn't tell me. I don't know if it's cotton. It looks like it's cotton. I don't know because it was my mom's and she cut the tag out. Let me write this down. Hogwarts sweater. Next. This is Star Wars size. Medium. It is a Millennium Falcon gray t shirt. And this is a six dollar start. All I can think of is Buzz Lightyear <laughs> to infinity and beyond. Oh, my husband would have loved that. Of course, it's too small. He would probably have been like, I'll put that up on the wall. That's one of the best ships in Star Wars, people. I'm just kind of dancing. I'm losing my speed. My back's starting to hurt really bad. <laughs> Any interest in this guy? There's nobody coming in for the Millennium Falcon. There it is. The Millennium Falcon. And this was my mom's t-shirt. And she, again, she is a stand, usually a size extra large. And that does fit her. So if that helps, let me know if y'all want it. Okay, next. Paints. No boundaries, size large. Stretchy flare bell bottom leggings. Cheetah print. We like them loud in this house. These will be a $4 start. The flare down here. The flare. You need you some cheetah print flare pants. All right. You need it. I would look so... Why don't I wear scarves anymore? I need to. Hide, hide, hide this. And then I'm just adorable. Does everyone hate this part of you? You're supposed to like... Okay, tell me if this works. Tell me if this goes... If this, if this goes away, okay? <laughs> I don't know how to do it. It's supposed to be like exercise. Did it go away? Too. I don't think it went away, did it? Mari is in a fourth. I don't. I don't like mine. I'm just like. I, I feel like that made it worse. Like it pushed it out. <laughs> Does it? Yeah. <laughs> Setting your jaw, is that what you were doing? Uh, you're supposed to like do something with your tongue and it makes it go away. I have no idea. <clears throat> Hi, Elizabeth. You're supposed to like put the, your tongue on the roof of your mouth.
Is that it? Was that it? Okay, tell me. I'm excited. I'm going to watch this back later. Are you ready? That was better. Thanks. <laughs> it's so hard. All right, listen. I think Mari wants these pants, man. Are we passing them in the line? Yes. Listen. Yes. Sadly, yes. Passing them in the Millennium Falcon. Okay, cool. Gina, you ready? And how much longer do you want to go? Because my body hurts and I have to be. Totally, Thank you, Mari. Totally up to you. I'm game for whatever. Well, I know you showed up late, but I've been on for two and a half hours. And I don't know how late you showed up. So I don't know how long you've been here. That's okay. I think it was only like 20 minutes to a half hour late. So it wasn't that late. I'm, I'm surprised okay. that it isn't here. Well, then I'll just let you go until you're ready to end. And that'll be it for me tonight. Okay. All right. Um, I was going to show this new attack, LuLaRoe Joy. Size XL. How dare you? I'm just I'm, I'm kidding. <laughs> An eight dollar start. Now XL is like um if it's like up to two three X. And the joy, it's new with tag, and the joy is sleeveless. And like so like that. So you can wear it like over a long sleeve dress or shirt. And I'm 5'2". Oh, it's got slits up the side to the waist that area. Is, that is the hippy-dippy. Mid-calf. What? That is the hippy-dippy. Yes, you need yes. your hat on. We need to see you in that and your hat. So. <laughs> the hat's in the other room. <laughs> but that's how, how that works. <laughs> how much was your start? Eight? $8 start. Yep, new with tags. It's called a joy. It's a size XL, but it runs really large. It's really pretty. You know what a joy is? You. Really? Three yeah. <laughs> You're a joy, Gina. Don't ruin my joke. <laughs> <laughs> that was made for you. Why aren't you keeping it? I because I'm like, where am I where am I gonna go this summer? Where? <laughs> I was gonna wear it over my long sleeve uh, dresses, but no. You can wear that to Goodwill. We know you're going yeah. there. <laughs> wear it out shopping. Let's go. Oh, I totally would. I wear this in kimonos over dresses all summer long. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. I'm out. I'm out there letting the freak flab fly. You know what I mean? <laughs> Sometimes you just want to layer. And the arms jiggle. It gets, it's too hot for that shit. Uh -uh. I'll burn to death. I pass them like kimonos because they're really lightweight. Like they just throw them over like a sleeveless dress. You can oh, barely, barely yeah, barely. Oh, All right, well, no one's one. gonna buy it. Maybe I will wear it this summer. <laughs> That's probably why everybody's like, "No, we pass them because they're too pussy." All right, I showed a whole bunch of towers, Sandy, but there were way too many to show again. Um, if you have any special requests, I'll show some of my favorites. This guy was 20. This guy is like, I think it is an ocean jasper. It has druzies. It has druzies right there. Cameron, or Carmen. And druzies right here. Carmen came in at eight. Enjoy. Oh, all righty. Carmen, what is yours? Thank you. <laughs> That's cute. Ooh. <laughs> well, you modeled it, so it's like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Carmen. So, yeah, this this guy is twenty dollars. Gorgeous. That was one of my favorite towers I showed. That was like vintage looking, seriously. The colors in it. Yeah. Groovy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this guy was 18, a fireworks Jasper. It's really cool. And if 18 is not in your budget, I have an $8 one. Oh, wow. It's a little guy, little $8 it, fireworks. It does look like fireworks. It really does. Yeah. 
Patty says eight. Patty, pause. You got it, Patty. Thank you. Well, that's within their personal account. I know the police had questioned their note, but they find a way to question me. And where did you get the note? I got it. And then started the book. Yeah, that's what I was working Um, I still have this bamboo jasper sphere. Babette, you had asked about smaller spheres. This guy is 22. Really cool looking material. Looks like little yellowy blobs. <laughs> Sandy <laughs> and Michelle. Patty, I would love to see a picture of your stone collection. <laughs> you have got to have a really good collection. <laughs> you want a really small bit, but okay. I'm sorry. I don't have any super small ones. I mean, I do, but they're in the other room and I'd have to go through them. Um, I have this really pretty, really light smoky quartz tower. This guy is $10 if anyone wants him. Gina, give me the bigger one instead. Yeah, no problem. As long as you did notice this little, like, it has like a little white area, but that's natural. Not a problem. Thank you. Oh, and Patty, you'll take the um smoky quartz. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, this one's really cool. It's like super cloudy at the bottom and it just goes into clear. Really cool. And it's kind of like flat. It's not a chonker like your usual favorites. <clears throat> Proud American. <laughs> well, what if I send a, a stick of stage sick a stick of sage with it, huh? <laughs> I'm surprised no one's gotten the fluorite owl yet. It is a, bigger than the, the, the average carving, and this guy's 25. It's like a smoky fluorite. Owl with a top hat. <laughs> Patty! <laughs> Did you really? Oh, I got, I got her sister right here. She's only 20. You get creepy doll's sister. I got the stone cat for 22. Stone cat with fish. Look at his eyes. Tell me he's not stoned. <clears throat> oh, good night, sugar plum. Have a good night. Do you know I'd like the hippie overcoat for 12? Oh, Lana, um, it was already purchased. How much on Stone Kitty? Stone Kitty is 22. Yeah, and I've had that creepy doll for a while. Patty has her sister. This creepy doll is like a red and red and gray. She's 20 and the cat is 22. Stone cat is holding, it's like a stone cat holding a fish with a beetle back. It's very interesting. 
and not 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 your average cattail. It's like a stub tail. I don't know what's going on. Where did Miranda go? That looks like one of those lucky cats. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> and a good dog. <laughs> <laughs> How much for the creepy doll or the keeper? <laughs> How much repay you to keep her? Well, she's. I'm enjoying her. I have a feeling no one's gonna buy her. <laughs> Scare of cat. Scare of cat? Yeah, I don't know. I still have the koala for twenty eight. Oh, Black and koala. I love the eye. So cute. And again, this is bigger. That's why it's a little more. It is bigger. Uh, Babette says it's the fourth tower available. Babette, um, the Smoky Quartz Tower sold, and so did the smaller Smoky Quartz. I have Red Hematoid Quartz Towers left. Oh, that's nice. I have a Fire Quartz Tower left, as far as Quartz goes. I have Rose Quartz Towers. I still have lots of Amethyst Towers left, too. Oh, my. <laughs> Did someone buy it and send it to Proud American? Oh, gosh. Oh, you don't need a creepy doll. Sandy, I can't at this time. I'm sorry. I got to save for my yoga elephant tomorrow. <laughs> Babette, did you mean this one? Because this one sold. This one here already sold. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, you showed it a few minutes ago. She said. Yeah, I think that was it. Still have the big fluorite chunky for 45. Wow. Really chunky. It has such a cool um, ombre coloration to it. Yeah, and see the those purple banding in there too against like the teal green color. Oh, no wow. problem, Babette. This is so freaking cool. Oh, that's so cool. And again, another one that looks just like the ocean. I mean, it yeah. really does. Yeah, but bet this is the last round, so I'm just showing things quickly until we end. I'm showing a few things that didn't sell, and yep. So Miranda, I'm, I can be done if you want. Okay. I don't care. You can show a little bit more. We can be done. It's up to you. <laughs> yes, this is a fan, and it's a round tower too. Those are more more rare, you know. Yeah, she already said I need a sugar daddy now. <laughs> it's really cool. It, it reminds me of a candle. Yeah. For the points. Oh, I still have this banded fluorite for 17. Oh, yeah. Man, this lighting. Is it directly in front of you or off to the side? It's to the side. I can't get it in front of me, unfortunately. <laughs> uh, girl, you need it in front of you. And now it's even more in front of me. Like right now, it's it's facing the fluorite tower right now, and it still looks dark. Like what is going on? It's because it's not directly in front of you. It's because of the camera angle. I can't. It won't go there. It's the, it's the camera <laughs> angle, I promise. <laughs> that's, that's that's the issue I'm running into right now. Because of where I'm at. But when it's in front of me, it's perfect. Uh, Carol wants to know how much that is. This banded fluoride is 17.
Y'all are killing me with the offers tonight, man. <laughs> Kale wants to know if she can or, get 15, please. Yes, I can do that one for 15, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Carol. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> wow, this will work for rocks. <laughs> Oh, yeah, the owl. Yep, no one wanted the owl. Carol, you tell your daughter to stop being sick and to get better right now. You tell her I said so. What does she have? Seriously, nobody wanted the owl? Yeah, I'm shocked. How cute is he? Where's Dean when we need him? I heard Dean is not collecting owls anymore. No, say the I know, right? Dean missed some really cool stuff that I picked up, too. Jonathan said, end of the month sales, let's go. <laughs> I still have the purple fluorites for $10. For $10. I still have the pink tourmaline for 14 Oh, I'm working on it, Patty, for sure. <laughs> I think I, I found one, but I don't think I bought it. <gasps> what? Yeah. You didn't buy I might, it. I might have bought it. I don't remember. There's a box of stones that's on its way to me, but I don't know when it's going to get here. <laughs> oh, wow. So we'll have this guy, only a $25 starter by it now. One side of it is uh, just like mostly light blue. See all that? Yeah. It's a big freak form. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Carol. Yeah, that seems to be going around. Oh, I'm sorry, Sandy. Oh, yeah, that moon man was so, so cool. The aliens are of the same quality that I have still. These aliens are beautiful carvings. These are 22 and 25. Spiderweb Jasper and like a snow quartz. <laughs> Carol. <laughs> so yeah, that's uh, a lot of what's still left. I mean, there's still lots more. I still have the Snowflake Obsidian Tower. For 26, it is chunkier than the usual tower, and these are also very hard to come by. <clears throat> when you do find them, they're not that cheap. Didn't they used to be a little bit more prevalent? <clears throat> what? Didn't they used to be more prevalent than they have been lately? The snowflake obsidian? Well, you know, I feel like the tumbles are super easy to find, and uh, like palm stone sometimes, but the towers have been really challenging to find. Wow. Hi, Nina Lover. We post everywhere. Um, shipping is extra, so you have to pay for your own postage. Uh, if you just get that one thing, it'll probably be around $15 um, with the pirate ship X simple export rate. Yes, yeah. hi, Nina Lover. We ship I'll everywhere. Ship <laughs> yep, as long as you're willing to pay the shipping. And they did raise their rates. I noticed that Last time, something was like, I think it was like two pounds and something. It was like well under four. It was 23 and change. And then another time, it was only like 17.95. I don't understand. 
It could yeah, be I, I think it could be 23. So as long as you're willing to pay that. It looks like it's less than um less than a pound. Um that bet says Oh yeah, like the one thing should definitely, yeah. Yeah, that'll be between like what 10 probably around $15. I would assume. I think anything under a pound is roughly 10 bucks. Babette wants the Snowflake Obsidian from you. And then uh, Nino Lover, just let us know if you want it. And make sure you send your info to the Spunky Meow at Yahoo. Send your YouTube name, your real name, your shipping address, and then your PayPal email so she can invoice you. Wow, Thank you, Babette. I have you down for the Snowflake. Thank you. Yep, and Nino, as long as I get your info, we're good to go. Nino hasn't bought from you before? Nope. It's nice to meet you. I'm Miranda. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> I remember seeing, did I, I saw Nino Lover somewhere the other day. Yeah, P &B, P &B said that they've seen him before in other options. Yeah, I think they are in Laura's chat the other day. Oh, well, nice to meet you. Wow. I love your Vegemite. <laughs> oh, okay, Michelle. For one pound and under. Yeah, because it used to be that. Well, anyway, the first time I ever quoted you, it was seventeen ninety five for the. I thought it was like just over two pounds, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh, they're at Laura's all the time. Laura's Stone Auction. All right, well, I'll put you down for the white alien. And thank you, Nino Lover, and I'm uh, just waiting for your information. I know, I know. me too, PMB, vitamin me to vitamin. I always think that, yeah. That was such a good episode. Yes, it was. That one and the chocolate factory one. Oh, my God. Yes. Are we ready to say goodbye, or are you waiting until you get that email? I'm good. I uh, I don't have um, Nino's information yet, but uh, I have them down for it. But I think we're we're good to go. I'm sure I'll get it. If not, I could uh, ask Laura. That is a correct moon, though. Thank you guys so much. I'm hungry. Me too. I need my ramen cook stick. I need some food. I could have cereal. I don't think I want cereal though. Can't tell you want cereal? Oh. Yeah, baby, come here. Want this? No, ouch. Why are you stabbing me? Okay, thank you, Nina Lover. I got your information. If you could just give me your address as well, though, that way I can pop it in and get like an exact um, estimate. That would be appreciated. But thank you. Otherwise, I'm going to just e email you right back and ask you for your address. <laughs> I just want to double check.
Good night, everybody. Night, everybody. Thanks for coming and finding stuff. All right. Good night, guys. Uh, tomorrow's Friday. Friday night. I usually have Lucid and Cha Cha on with me. I don't know if that's going to be the case tomorrow. Um. If anything, I'll be on, and it'll probably be later, since I have to finish clearing out the storage unit, and then do a little bit of shop a popping with my mama, and uh, then I'm going to start boxing everybody's orders up. I've already started boxing some people's orders up, because they had, they had enough stuff for, like, a big box. So, I love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye, everybody.